Hello and welcome, I'm Marumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's continue our playthrough of Civ V Communitas as Siam. So, what to do here? So we've got some of our very high food territory being blocked by the swordsman here. I, I actually forget who this guy was. Assyria. Oh yeah, yeah, you're a jerk. We know. So, even still, we're about to see our, our capital grow in spite of the enemy. Um, now we're, we're also building a granary. So we, we have to click next turn and, and let them kick kick our butt for a turn. Whoa. Whoa. Yes, of course. We we will accept your embassy. We're busy though, just just so you know. And we're apparently uh, trespassing in Kiev, um, which is a, it's a big deal. Kiev's really mad about it. Um, we're trying to get out, man. I swear. Choose a promotion. They seem to have removed the heal unit promotion, which is unfortunate. Let's take open terrain, since we have quite a bit of open terrain here. This unit's not going to be very effective, but, um, you know, it is what it is. So, I do want to try to protect the iron. He is really enveloping us. Look at this. Arch, arch, archer. And swordsman. Pikes. That's my captured worker, I believe. This worker, obviously, is going to need to retreat to the city. Or at least back here, someplace safe. Alright, so you should take your pot shot. You should take your pot shot. You should take your pot shot. Unfortunately, we can't kill it unless we do this. Which I think is fine. We want to remove as many units as possible. Let's do this. Since this one's going to have to cross a river, I'd prefer for this one to be weaker. I actually don't want to move in, because then he'll he'll be surrounded on many sides. In fact, I think we might just want to... Since we're in our own territory here, I think we fortify. Right? We'll give him a defensive bonus and hopefully allow them... I don't know, may, maybe they get their health recovered this turn? I'm not sure. Let's weaken that pike slightly. It's not going to do too much. We got 463 gold. You still need orders. You can't bombard again, right? You haven't attacked yet. Why don't we actually retreat you? Uh, back here. Try to keep it alive. I'm okay with you staying on the mountains. Um... Although, we could put him on the other side of the river to give him even more protection. That does open up the mine and the iron. Well, the iron's going to go no matter what I do. He's going to sack the iron next turn. The question really is, do we want him on this side of the river? Or do we want him in the hills? Cherry Darcher's not so good in melee, so I guess we probably want him on the opposite side. <coughs> and this one's got the uh, guy right there. They go up the hills. They can embark and they have drills. They have, yeah, I think we want to actually retreat with this guy. To here. He can go up the hills, but he can't attack. That's all of our dudes. That's it. Trespassing in Kiev still. Ooh, this war is nasty. Okay, um, we're about to produce a smith. I uh, apologize. I, I completely forget what a smith does. Can trade production to friendly... Oh, yes, this is right. We built one in the other city, didn't we? And it's making a caravan. Probably not the most logical thing to be making at this moment, but um, it is what it is. About to finish our granary there. That's important. Okay, um, I think we need to purchase... Ah, shoot. I never... I didn't remove the bowman from that city. Can we purchase something over here and then get it across quickly? Hmm. I don't still recall. Do we have bridges yet? I don't think we have bridges. We don't have bridges. So, unfortunately, if we buy something, it's still going to take a couple turns to get over. Ugh. This is going to be a brutal turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
10 units. We're definitely going to lose a swordsman or something. You know what I should do is, um, here, let's actually see if it'll let me... Nope. <laughs> Never mind. Um, this is a big war, though. Let's turn off the uh, single-player quick combat for now. So we can, like, pay closer attention to this, this battle. You know, because, like, I, I, mi I mean... It's like playing chess, but then you, like, have to walk away and let the enemy take their turn, and then you're like, okay, so what did you do? Like, try to figure it out. And the animations don't take as... not that long, really. Did we get him? Can you bombard from here? No. Can you go up here and then attack? I hope. Probably. No, they can't. Seriously? Oh, shoot, it's hills. Damn it. Hmm. New caravan. Can we ship even more production? Is that, is that allowed? No, we can't. We can send it to the other city, though. Sure, why not? Let's do that for a while. More production is always nice. Sweden, you're supposed to be helping here, you know. Okay, well they didn't sack the iron, which is kind of surprising. I would have expected this guy to have moved over and sacked it. but And they did not kill the Siamese, Siamese swordsman here. Kaboom. <coughs> That was a little bit of damage, not much. At the risk of advancing, let's see what happens. Come on, the archers, we should, yeah, we should totally slaughter. Now that swordsman's a bit scary, the pikes are kind of stuck behind. And I actually want to keep a couple of the, the for frontal units really weak and not kill them in this case, just so that um, the pikes can't advance. This is actually really advantageous for us, having this river. Even though we're not built on a, on a hill, which maybe would have been better, um, we're on the other side of the river, so that's nice. Damn it, I did it again. I didn't move the, the bowmen from either location. Crap. That might cost me. And do we move you back now? Probably, yeah. This archer can just fortify until healed. Or at least heal for a turn. While defending your spearman was destroyed. So we only lost one unit last turn. And now we have, what? Finished our granary. What should we be making? Well, we're at war, so I, suppo I suppose it'd be best to make military. Let's add to queue. Let's, let's get a couple spearmen queued up. And you have just finished a caravan, which we've already sent somewhere. We could crank out some swordsmen. Actually, there's no military unit here. Let's just... Let's just purchase a swordsman. In a couple turns, apparently. Uh, let's go back to producing then, and I guess we'll produce a swordsman. We've got iron, and they are our best military unit right now. I still don't really know what it means when it says city attack, city defense. Does that mean they're like really strong at defending in the city? And really strong at attacking the city? That's what it seems like it would mean, but I don't know. Okay, hopefully this will go a little slower, and we can actually see how the battle unfolds. These guys are fortifying. They're choosing to shoot over the thing at my chariot archer. Okay. They are starting to try to blast my city. In fact, they conquered, or like, they, they did... 
Didn't they attack and then they ran away? What happened there? Hmm. I, I feel like we're okay. I don't think we're going to lose a city in this war. I could be mistaken. Man, forts. 10 adjacent damage. That's pretty powerful. Wow. Villages are worth a lot. Why is that worth so much? Sure. I guess we make a village. Okay, so we need to get the bowmen out. So, well, no, we're going to save up for a swordsman in the capital. Let's, uh, let's see. There's actually no one nearby here, so we can advance forward a bit. And this guy was essentially, um, a melee guy. You gotta run right up and then shoot. And then we'll back him right back up again to here. A little concerned about swordsman guy. I feel like he's gonna die. Um, can't really s take a turn to set up, so I guess we'll let you shoot that guy down. He's going to keep getting pelted by the archers. Let's just tell him to heal. He looks like he'll probably be safe. I can still change your command, right? No, I cannot. No, yeah, I can. Okay. So I think we're actually going to have you bombard. Got to get this pike out of the way. I want to protect these weaker units and keep them off of our river. <coughs> Excuse me. So the pike's pretty weak. Wait, wait, what? Why is stuff happening while I am in the middle of my turn? Oh, I see. Assyria is now the ally of Melbourne, and therefore they've joined the war. Okay. Well, something I've done just apparently caused them to join the war. Maybe units lost, or who knows what. Okay, but this archer needs to do something. If we move him to here, can he shoot that? I think yes. I'd kind of like to keep the city defense up since they are starting to attack it. Next turn, we're not going to quite have enough for the purchase of a of a swordsman. It's going to take 20 gold, and we only make 14. So how about we keep you here for one turn, and you bombard that guy to protect all that nonsense. Really, it's the swordsman I want to keep alive. Make that guy weak. It's good. You can wait there. We're not at war with any of these guys. You could make a village there, or we could make mines all over the place. I think we focus on production. Assuming that the production that is sent through trade routes is based on the production of a city, you know, like maybe it's 10% of the total production rounded to the nearest integer, then I, I, st I just feel like we should maximize production there. Okay. Are we winning this war? Do we feel like we're winning? Ich sehe, ihr bewundert meinen neuen Damast. Soll keiner sagen, ich sei eine ungerechte Frau. We'll keep your your deal going. It's Min hard. Det är min övertygelse att den uppgörelse kan gagna både mitt och ert folk. Yes, I'll declare a declaration of friendship with you. Okay, they actually didn't attack anything. They just moved around a lot. Looks like they've rotated their front line with their back line. Which is good. That gave us a turn to just kind of hang out. A barracks in a distant city enlisted a new military personnel, apparently. Okay, so first things first. Let's see if, hey Sweden, since you've just declared a declaration of friendship, why don't you... Ah, welcome. Um, shall you declare Fintet. war on... Um, uh, that's the guy, right? We've been over this before, the answer's still... What are you talking about? I demand you declare war on that guy. 
I demand it. <laughs> no. That's suicide, right? Alright, well, let's, um... Let's take care of upgrades first. Yep. Stick with... Stick with open for now, I, th I think. Barrage 2, rough train. Sure. We're already going down that path with this guy. Are you in range of anything? Doesn't look like it, actually. So you can just fortify till healed for a turn. The other person that can be upgraded is our new spearman. Could, could make him recon, or maybe just do the more open. We do want to move both units from this tile so that we can buy... Actually, we can we can move them next turn. Don't think we want to cross the river. I think we just put the spearman here. And we let the archer take a pot shot. And weaken both of them just so they do less damage. They're not nearly as effective when they're not at full health. Look at all this undefended land. Of course, you're going to take a pot shot of my city now. Oh, I see you're actually coming up. Thought that was my guy. Whoopsie. This chariot archer. Hmm. Unfortunately, we can't actually attack anything this turn. That's unfortunate. I guess you heal. And you can heal. And you can fortify or heal. Or just wait. <laughs> Plus three gold, or we could get plus plus one. Oh, that's right, no access to fresh water, that's why. Well, might make more sense to upgrade like this wheat over here or something, so I guess we send you that way. Pretty disappointed that we lost that worker. But he seems to be retreating, I think. Not sure. I want to take a break here, and hopefully in the next video we will turn this war around, maybe even take this weak little city from him. We'll see. So thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you again soon.